Hey YouTube! In this video, I'll be showcasing my open source trading bot that I've been working on that's generating me thousands of dollars in passive income with the help of artificial intelligence. This bot might sound complex to many at first, but it's really not. There's these cryptocurrency exchanges called decentralized exchanges. You can trade different tokens on these exchanges for a fee. This fee can be arbitraged with my bot, giving you a profit. An example of a decentralized exchange is Uniswap. Many of you have probably heard of this before. Put simply for those who don't understand arbitraging, the bot operates on sandwiching transactions. It analyzes transactions on decentralized exchanges that have been initiated but not yet processed. It picks these certain transactions to specify higher gas prices than the initiated prices, allowing us to process our transaction first, then process a sell order right afterwards. Meaning the pending transactions get sandwiched by hours giving us profit in the slippage. I understand if this sounds complicated, I'll put up a graphic to help you understand the concept. Either way, you don't need to understand entirely to get started earning passive income. Setup is very easy and you don't need any coding experience whatsoever. The code is plug and play, ready to go as is with zero editing needed. All right, let's not waste any time, let's get started. First, make sure you have the MetaMask browser extension installed. You'll need a Web3 wallet like MetaMask to interact with Remix. There's many different Web3 wallets you can use other than MetaMask. They'll all work with Remix. MetaMask is the easiest and safest to use, in my opinion. Now we'll go to Remix. Remix is used for creating Solidity-based smart contracts. I'll put a link to Remix along with everything else you need in the description below. It may take some time for Remix to load. Patiently wait while everything loads in. Now move over to the sidebar and create a new contract under the contracts folder. Name it bot.sol. In the description, I've linked the bot source code. This is open source. Feel free to verify the code yourself if you'd like to prove its legitimacy. Copy the code and paste it into the file bot.sol you've just created. This is our bot. Everything is already set by default. Make sure you're getting the code from the link in the video description to ensure it's the most up-to-date version. Before we compile our bot, make sure to read the quick user guide at the top. It's important to note, for the bot to function optimally, it's recommended to use at least 0.5 Ethereum or more. 0.5 Ethereum is an absolute minimum. Anything less runs the risk of absolute losses due to low liquidity. The more Ethereum you deposit into your bot, the more transactions it processes, resulting in increased profits. For demonstration purposes, I'll be using one Ethereum. Normally I'll run my bots with higher amounts of Ethereum like five, 10, 20, sometimes 50 Ethereum. Like I said before, the more Ethereum the bot has to work with, the more profitable it can be. Let's go over to the Solidity Compiler tab now. On the very top of the code, you'll see it's built with the 0.8.4 version of Solidity. Under Compiler, select the 0.8.4 version so that it matches our contract. Also, make sure the language is set to Solidity and EVM version is set to default. Click on compilebot.sol and wait for the bot to compile. Now, let's deploy this from our wallet. Head over to the Deploy and Run Transactions tab. Here, select Injected Provider as the environment. MetaMask will pop up. Just connect it. Everything looks good. Click deploy. I always set gas fees to aggressive. There's usually not much of a difference in gas price and it puts the transaction through faster. Let's wait for the transaction to confirm. Nice. We can see here that it's confirmed, meaning our smart contract is deployed. Scroll down and click this. Now you can see the bot's control panel. These two are for more advanced users. Don't touch them unless you've used bots like this before. Start Native will start the bot, enabling it to read mempools. Stop will stop the bot exiting mempools. 
Withdraw will withdraw the entire bot's balance back to your wallet. Debug can be used if you run into issues. Let's copy the smart contract address with this button here and paste it into Etherscan to make sure it's created. Yep, it was created successfully. Now let's run the contract. I'll copy the smart contract address once more and head over to MetaMask. Make sure you've got the right address in there. Let's put one Ethereum and set gas fees to aggressive again. Nice, transaction confirmed. Now the bot has Ethereum to work with. Perfect. Now, the last step is to click Start Native. Let's set the gas fee to aggressive and click Confirm. I'm going to let the bot run for a full day and review our results. All right, so it's been over a day. I stopped the bot, but I haven't checked the profits yet. Let's refresh Etherscan and see where we're at. Wow, it's over 2.9 Ethereum. That's 1.9 Ether gained in a single day. It still surprises me how well this works. Now, let's retrieve our bot's balance. Since the bot is already stopped, we can now click the withdraw button. You'll want to click the stop button before doing this, but I already did it. Let's click it. This will charge us a little bit of gas. I'll set it to aggressive again and click confirm. There we go, transaction confirmed. Let's go to our MetaMask. Sweet. As you can see, the bot's balance is in my wallet. Keep in mind, this is only after 24 hours. The profits will fluctuate day to day. If you have any questions, I'll put my Telegram link in the description. I've been working on this for a long time and I could have easily charged money for it. All I'm asking is that you like this video and subscribe to my channel. Anyway, seriously, give this a try. I'll see you guys in the next one.